All right, so what we're going to do here, we're going to try out this turboplane. Um, this is an Arbortech turboplane. It's a three-bladed disc that you can purchase and attach to any standard uh, four and a half inch grinder. Now, the way it works is you need a grinder that has two washers. One is the locking washer. That's locks in place once it's tightened down and then the hole on this is 7 eighths the shaft is 5 eighths I'm going to fit that on because there's a little ridge on that washer that keeps it centered and then there's a washer for the grinder standard typical washer you find on most grinders um, there's a, a ridge on one side that you would normally put down to center your grinding disc or cutting wheels or your cutting grinding stones but in this case you're going to turn it opposite way so that the flat side of the washer fits right flush with your disc and uh, because the groove is on this washer to keep it centered it's not really rocket science you just Turn the washer around, tighten it down, and you're good to go. Now, if you're left handed or right handed, you put your handle on your grinder, whichever way. All we gotta do now is plug it in, go outside, find a log, and let's see how this peels bark off a log. So, here we are. We got some uh, pine that we're going to grind off, and we got some uh, larch, tamarack, and there's some spruce. So we'll just try some different woods that we have here. There might be some beech over there too. All this stuff was cut several months ago. Uh, I'm guessing this won't have any trouble taking this off. So let's get busy. Definitely works. It's going to take some getting used to. Um, there's a lot of material that gets kicked up onto your fingers. Um, so I'm guessing these little cotton gloves really don't do the trick. Uh, you want a, a stronger set of gloves. And uh, that's what I'm going to go get now and then we'll try this again.
those are my that's my very first attempt uh, with a cutoff disc and uh, it does what it says it's advertised to do of course me not really having a handle on you know using it efficiently effectively or knowing really what it can do other than just power plane um, it can certainly remove a lot of material and you can see even with removing the knots um, it does that really well a couple things to keep in mind you, once I put on the second set of gloves it uh, made a big difference in in uh, you know the debris that was flying into your hands you didn't really notice it at all now I'm wearing a helmet and uh, a face shield but it's a mesh face shield I wasn't wearing any safety glasses in behind it good idea to wear safety glasses um, because the small bits of dust and dirt and that kind of stuff that gets kicked up from planing um, will pass through the mesh and you find yourself blinking a lot so safety glasses are in order as well and of course hearing protection so yeah uh, definitely worth it and I'm sure once I get used to uh, using it more other than just you know brute force planing I'm sure it'll come in handy when it comes into carving some of the larger stumps for uh, doing other carving projects.